Hello everybody, Tusk Zero One here, welcome to Guys Melody Another Vlog. This is a sequel to the first Guys Melody game made by Echo 607. Now this was made in I believe RPG Maker 2000. So it's gonna be pretty interesting to see. Background's pretty nice in the opening here. Hi Pop Pop. Come here. Oh she came to say hi. Say hi. Hi. So um, with all this, um, I do expect the game to crash. Um, at some point, I have needed to um, find assets that were missing in the game. So, I've done my best to see what I could find that was missing and get that in there. So, that's just a forewarning, you guys. If it looks a little weird, if I just go like, oh crap, the game crashed! Let's start our adventure. Yes, I would like cutscenes and save points and all that. Now, I've already done recordings of this, but the audio was uh, not too great. There was a time not long ago where I was forced to play the hero. A great adventurer, you could say. But to me, all I wanted was to see my sister again. I was young, childish. I still am. I found my sister, but she ended up uh, having to go away again. This time for good. What she told me was to live, to be happy. That's a promise. So, for the last four years, that's what I've been trying to do. But something's wrong. It's like I've forgotten something important. Echo, if you were here, would you? Would I understand? I wonder about that. But there's something off in the air again. Echo, if I asked you to save me again, would you come? Yeah, so the last stuff that I've recorded <clears throat> for about six episodes worth. Ooh, a dream. Like that again. Music way overpowered my voice for so many things. Because the audio done here. Yeah. Nice little balcony. Um, can I get just like loud? Or a while, but then it just, it just dips down. So it just goes like we start down here, then we go up here, but then we go back down to here. You know, my voice is like somewhere here, and that didn't work out too well. <laughs> oh, it's an Eka. You're new. Good morning, Akira. Uh, I was going to wake you up if you didn't come down soon. You sure sleep, you sure sleep a lot. An a strange girl. She started just. She just suddenly appeared one day, and has been living with Kachi, Tara, and Tadase, and I ever since. Where'd everyone else get off to? I'm not really sure. I think Kachi said something, but I wasn't listening. <laughs> Sorry! And what about you? Trying to burn down the house this early in the morning? Uh, uh, uh I wouldn't burn down the house! <laughs> uh, uh, Aneka? Catchy's room! About a year ago, me and Catchy made plushies of each other. The idea was to give them to each other, but she kept the one she made for me instead. She always was a strange one. It's just a doll. A very weird doll. Get costumes! Yeah! We can't open those chests yet. Wait, did I get the Kira's thing over here? Nope, here we go. Pretty much alternate costumes for the characters. And this is Tara's room. She has a cat. Uh, see? Nothing's on fire. You and Tara worry too much. Clearly for a good reason. And, hey, this is a Neka's room. But Tadase doesn't live here, not in this house. I'm going out, so try not to burn anything down while I'm gone, okay? Okay! She may act normal, but every now and then she'll say something strange. She seems to have amnesia too. I wonder if, th if that's why we decided to let her stay with us. I'll be back later! Now this first episode might be a little long, so 
so just let you guys know because I have to find a different way to keep track of the time here. Whoa! That tremor. There was there was one bleh, there was one earlier too, wasn't there? Hey, Tadase! Those seem to be getting a lot more frequent frequent lately. You okay, Kira? Of course I am, Tadase. Right. Uh, I wonder what's causing all those sudden tremors. Plus the monsters that used to live here all left. Uh, Tara said they fled down the mountain all scared-like. I want to check on them. They're our friends after all. Even if they are monsters. They are good monsters. <laughs> oh, oh, why are you out here, Tara say? You weren't waiting for me to wake up or something, were you? Like a creep. Tara say, don't be a creeper, please. You were bad. You were a little bad in the first game. <laughs> no, I... Uh... No? I have something I want to talk to you about, so... Meet me at the far edge of the cliff down there, when you're done checking on the monsters, alright? Okay... How to say, you need to give up. So it's been four years, plus all the years you've known her, so... Let's say they've known each other for about eight years. She's clearly not interested, Tata say. You need to just confess. Just get it out of your system. She will reject you. And you can move on and live a healthier life. Because you're you're not health you're not very healthy right now. Hello, Kira. Hello, Mr. Tadase's dad. Do you want to chat, or shall I sell you some items? I've got a great bargain, let's talk first. Gotta see your chipper as ever. I've lost some pounds, it's great. No more lazy shopkeep for me. That scare and terror lulls sure made me rethink my life. But I take rest. That's enough rambling on me. Take care of my boy, you hear? Of course you will. You see, we, not I. Her and her friends. Like. Yeah, but I won't be your daughter or nothing. That won't happen. Sell me some items. Ooh, see, that's a nice transition. This is so good. Um, nah, we're we're, we're gonna keep plenty of these. We're gonna keep our monies for now, because I already know what happened. Hi. Hey, there, buddy. Uh, isn't it great that Tadase's dad was nice enough to let me live here? Most of the survivors from Terralos ended up moving here. It's almost like nothing's changed, huh? Except Echo, that is. No, oh, uh, hey, uh, I'm sorry. I forget I said anything. Yeah, I couldn't get the bad ending with your axe. I was just way too dang strong. There was literally nothing I could do. Watering! I'll take it. Yeah. So let's equip that ring. Nice. Poppers. Yeah. All oh, these people they just talk like all the new tarot laws and stuff like that. Oh, Mickey and Nikki live here. See? It's their place. Ether. Anything? No? No. See, and up here? That was like one of the speed drawings Echo did for Christmas. One, one, one time. That's nice. There's a lot of cool little things here. I was hoping Mickey and Nikki were home, but it looks like they're out. That little brat. When he comes back, I'll make him pay. Pay? What are you talking about? Pay for what? What, what are you talking about? Having a oh the monster well bleh, the monsters are here in the tavern still. Boobies. <laughs> yeah, but we can't go any further or anything. But it's like ah monsters, squishies. Rip, rip. Can you believe it? Not Dr. Pepper's. Something about Dr. Pepper in there. Not sponsored. Let's see... Where do I want to go? Oh! Treasure! I want it! 
You're from Leaf Ring! It just happened the it, it was just a little little when it happened, but ever since the day Dad died and attacked me on, Mom hasn't been sane. Well you're from a different universe altogether. Crazy mother type character. I've lost count. Has it been two or three? Four years since that terrible day. Okay. Ghosts, ghosts. Ghosts, ghosts. Caught in that. That's just me. You're also from Pokemon. That's okay. So, whoa. I just jumped over the ed edge of the stairs. That's okay, though. Goldenrod. I can't use that. Uh, there's some other places down here where I can get stuff. Oh, let's talk to the other guy on the edge there. Eh, I'll go back. I'm going to take your stuff now, though. Hi. Are you dolls or peoples? What's going on here? Nothing, okay. Have fun. Bye. Mine! And I wonder if we're still under if the thing where you have to get piano, uh, bleh, learn musics to get skills. You're just dancing. What are you dancing for? Uh, nice fresh kitchen. Always best way to welcome the day. Care for a cookie? Heck yeah! Heck no! Whoa, whoa. I'm actually all out. Sorry, cutie. No! Why would you offer cookies if there are none? That's so mean. I'm in your bed. I hope we can save the world all day, just like a Kieran Kachi. Okay, and I'm stuck. Oh crap, I'm stuck! Okay. You don't... Why would you want to save the world? Like... Or save it in a way that you can, like a task? You know, do like something about it? But not literally, like, in your dimension battles kind of thing, because I'm kind of a goddess. You know, clone thing and uh yeah I'm all powerful. Oh shit. Yeah. Yeah it's basically he's not gonna let us go until we have all our party members. So I'm just here just gonna click all the items. Tonic what's going on here? I'm hungry! Get to complain, don't get to eat. That's what Echo taught me. But Kira, you always complain. I, I do not. I'm just uh, an unfortunate response. What? So bored, how about you? No. Good. That's dumb. You're always a Pokemon. You're sleepies. Invade your bed. Okay, now I'm out. Eh. Yeah, but this area is huge. I don't. I find it very difficult to actually make large maps when it comes to like towns and such and so forth. It's so hard. It's like you have an idea in your head, but then you can't do it. What are you doing over here? I'm hiding. Okay. Enjoy your hiding spot. Oh, inns are free here too. Let's see, uh, anything down here? There's Usa. What? I want to start the day with a walk, but it's too dang cold, so we should, should turn the woods, the woods, the world's heater on. Well, I never noticed this. What's in here? H potion. Nice. Excuse me, but I have to readjust my leg. Sorry. Oh no! There you go. 
nice and comfy. Alright, for me too. Hello? Hey, Tadasai. Yeah, if you come directly down here in the game, like immediately after Tadasai says something, well, he tells you to be in there, he won't show up. Tadasai, hiya! Uh, Akira! This is a childhood friend from Turtles. We've been through thick and thin together, and he's always been able to slap some sense into me. Though, he's been acting strange for a while now. He's been acting strange for a long time. Well, somewhat slow to notice that, but at least you're noticing. That's the important part. Uh, when did you get here? Um, just now? Yeah, right. That didn't take you very long. I was planning to check on the monsters down the mine, but despite all we've been through, the old man at the gate says I don't go. Typical. I swear, I swear saving the world means less than these people. I say I'm just, like, the characters themselves, like... It was like, we save the world, we stop interdimension bullshit, stop gods, uh, we destroyed uh, dimension, actually, and, uh, yeah. We're all freaking powerful, and yet the guy blocking the way says that we'll die? Excuse me, when was the last time you fought interdimensional demons? Well, things of that class, anyway. Hmm. Huh. Bet if I had you with me, he'd let me through no problem. What do you say? Oh, you want me to come with you? No, I didn't just say that. I just said maybe uh, you should come with me. And let's go. Uh, then I guess it'll be my job to protect you. Don't worry, Kira. I'll make him let us through. Sure, sure you will. Go, Tadase! Ha! <laughs> exactly, fear it not. I will! Uh, hey, wait for me! Oh, right. Wasn't there something you want to talk about? That's yeah, fine. It's nothing really anything important. Oh, good. Let's hurry then. He was like, yeah, no waste time. I don't know what your what your your deal is. Let's just go. Potion, gotta say. Uh, outfit. I uh, I like your G your GM one outfit better. Where are you? Oh, thought it. Yeah. He didn't like having a cape last time, so... No cape. You don't deserve a cape because you think capes are lame. Like capes. Cool. And breeze. Let's see, I already started quite a bit of this game already, but, uh... Audio! Alright. So, thank you for joining me, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Bye-bye!